Welcome to another uh, Saturday flight video and um, I've been uh, upgrading my um, Flyboo Nano FR16 uh, that's a 1S uh, quad, a little 1S quad that uh, was already very awesome with uh, HG0 not that much uh, or not that good with uh, Walkside because it was a little bit too heavy um, and uh, I now upgraded it with the AIO 5 from HG0, the one uh, piece board. And uh, boy, this is, uh, it, it's just uh, so much better because uh, I've shaved off a lead, maybe about 5 uh, grams of weight um, by uh, reusing basically the, the one board and also you know, shorter screws and um, it makes the, the build lighter. I also uh, print, 3D printed a, a canopy that I adjusted to the cam, the Lux cam. This is basically the heavier cam but with a better quality and uh, for me uh, yeah, it, this is a must, the Lux cam is a must because it really makes flying uh, you know, that much more fun. Um, it's agile now, uh, being below 30 grams. Um, you can feel the difference, it, the flight times are longer, I almost get maybe 2 minutes 50 seconds with, uh, with this uh, quad. Um, and the danger is with AO5 that you uh, basically go into, um, go into a, a low battery mode <laughs> because it, if it handles like uh, analog, you just can fly until the, basically the, the battery goes below 2 point, I think seven or eight or so and uh, yeah of course that's not good for the, for the lipos but uh, with it with this AO5 you don't have that cutoff anymore as you had with uh, with the normal HG0 whoop board so it's something nice you can fly longer but you have to really to, to be cautious of not degrading your battery or not breaking your battery so um, I've uh, quickly recorded two flights and I'll show you that thanks a lot for watching please like and subscribe if you Enjoy the content and so oh, the sun is, is very bright or <laughs> have a have a great day, have a great weekend. Take care. Bye bye.